Model Mine 72, doing a wicked screaming burnout in the Wicked Wizard Garage. This is a very, very special piece, ladies and gentlemen. Very, very special piece. This video might be a little lengthy, so grab a bag of popcorn and your favorite elixir. Let's do this. So, the, the Dotson off-road pickup goes way back in the Model Mine 72 history. I built this car, had to be one of the first printings uh, back in the early to mid-80s, I would say, and loved it. I built it box stock at the time because my skills was very lacking, and... Um, you know, I had very limited means of resources, uh, maybe a tube of glue and a few paint paints, you know, with some cheap brushes. It's about all the wizard had back in the day, kids. But here's the deal. All these years later, Reveal has decided to do a reboxing of this classic kit so you know i am so honored to have this kit back in the stash now this one right here was way back in storage buried under more storage which was buried under more storage and the box you know you can kind of see you know, it's had its day. It's brand new, factory sealed, but, you know, it's it's seen better days. So I was like, you know what? You, you love this kit. It's a part of your history. You must open this kit. You must build this kit with, your, with today's technology, with your skills, with your resources. You must go back and do a resurrection series build on this car. And that is the goal. I'm so honored to have reacquired this kit. Um, like I said, the first time I built it, it was box stock. And um, this time, I'm hoping to let loose my inner emotions, inspirations, and creativity and turn this kit into something that will blow my own model mind. So it will be in the lineup of the Resurrection series. Like I say, maybe over 35 years ago, I was in touch with this kit. And to be able to lay my hands on it today, it's overwhelming, guys. It's overwhelming. But every piece of this model will mean something to me. And I hope that it can translate to you guys as you watch me, as you follow along and watch me build it, you know, and as you gather inspiration from something that I hold very dear. So another thing is I'm going to use, if I can, I'm going to use some of the parts in this kit to um, add to some of my other Dotsons that I'm building, of course, you know. So um, that's going to be it's going to be very interesting. Like I said, with the box deteriorating and everything in storage. So we have the Reveal 124 scale Dotson off-road pickup. This is from the truck series. We're going to open it up right here on camera in front of everybody to see. Like I say, guys, this has been in storage for a while, so it really needs to be built because, uh, you know, it's just such a classic kit for me. And um, it means so much to me to have this back in the stash that we're going to go through each part here it looks like we got some glass here and um, i want to say those are the fog lights and headlights 
Either the headlights or fog lights. I think they're the headlights, guys. All right, so that's your glass. We have four um, off-road. I want to say they might have been actually branded back in the day. First time I built this over 35 years ago. But these are unbranded, probably because of licensing issues. I want to say mine said Goodyear, but I, I can't. Don't hold me to that. All right, we got one big bag of styrene goodness here. This four-cylinder engine, guys, man, I love that. That little four-banger. Man, like I said, when I first built this, it was box stock. Only had like some little tuba testers glue. Maybe a couple of few paints. But I pretty much built it box stock back in the day. But this time, I'm going to let loose on this model. And I'm going to give it anything and everything that I can throw at it. But the, the quality of this reveal pop, guys, I see. I really see no flash. Let's go ahead and get into this bag while we're here. So, let's deal with this. Uh, we're going to deal with this body first. Now, as I remember, the body was one piece. The, the, the bed came with the cab, just like you see here. Pretty much the same, the same way that I saw it over 35 years ago. You got your dots and badges on it. This was right before they changed from Dotson to Nissan. I don't know if you guys remember it or not, but some of you older guys might know that they went from the Dotson. Um, here you go. They went from the Dotson to the Nissan a badge. So this is back when they still were wearing the Dotsons. But actually on some of the engines, the valve cover said Nissan. Like on my 620, I believe the, the valve cover said Nissan on it. And matter of fact, if you can look right here, it says Nissan, just like I said. So my engine said Nissan on the valve cover, which tripped me out at the time because I didn't understand it. But now that I kind of understand the history of the Datsun, I, I get it, you know. All right, the cockpit jumped off the tree because it's, you know, ready to rock. This kit, total, it's a very simple kit. There's not much to it. You got two big trees of styrene here. You got your seats, your roll bar, your suspension. And then you got your um, frame, your back half of your cab, your dash, and your in engine. That is an awesome four banger. You could put that four banger in pretty much any model and be awesome with it. All right. Our last deal is our hood, which, you know, you got to love your hood, right? Man, I had so much fun building this model when I was a teenager. And I'm probably going to enjoy it even that much more now. It's just absolutely beautiful. Just beautiful. Just a beautiful body style and everything. Okay. So let's get on into it. We got one chrome tree this has got our um, rims our grill our bumper with the push with the grill guard got our nissan valve cover got our intake we got our air breather alternator gear shifter and some really big mirrors i never liked those big mirrors uh even way back when you know but i understand what a 4x4 kind of makes it a little bit beefier Okay, next thing, we got our Reveal Dotson Off-Road Pickup Instructions, which is pretty much typical of your Reveal Instructions. I'm sure you got your paint code. Nothing pretty much has changed. You know, very simple kit, but there again, just, you know, I'm very emotional about this build because I built it so long ago. It is going to be put in the Resurrection series. Last but not least, due to storage, dust, and whatever you want to call it, we have our decal sheet 
which gives us a Dotson in black, white. We've got our Fender flares. We've got our 4X4 Dotson uh, brand. We've got our 4X4 uh, graphic, which is very 80s, guys. So, guys, I was doing a little research on this model and found that I went on eBay to try to find the actual uh, truck that I built back in the day. I couldn't find it. I went on Amazon to try to locate the original one that I built. Couldn't find it. I started Googling it. And I'm not saying it's not on Google, but one after a couple of uh, attempts and not finding the original one that I built, all the more reason to let you guys know that nobody cares about this model kit except me. <laughs> now, of course, you got this reissue and everybody sees this one and they're like, oh, look at this and blah, blah, blah. But it wasn't so. Anyway. Reveal truck season, Dotson off-road pickup, 124 scale. Mine on the box was white. I remember it was white and it had some type of graphics on it that fails my memory. But it's, you know, it's been a long time, guys. But the original one that I did, it wasn't even a reveal. It was a monogram. It was a monogram Dotson. So, if any of you guys know what I'm talking about and can post a link to it in the comment section or locate the white one with the monogram uh, branding, uh, man alive, w would that be something, right? So, let's get on with it. Right here, we have the total contents of what's in the box. Not many uh, pieces, not, not not a high parts count or whatnot. Like I said, very simple kit uh, from back in the day. It looks like Reveal just pretty much retooled the old monogram one. And then, you know, and that's fine and everything. It looks like they did this in 2014. But there is your decal sheet. Like, like I was saying, you get your four cell sign, which I'll never sell this kit. In a million years, somebody, you know, after I die, somebody will probably sell it on eBay, you know, for five dollars because nobody's going to take care of my styrene empire. But while I'm here, this kit will be taken care of and it will be built to the highest caliber that I can imagine. And, you know, I can only hope that I can do this kit justice. So there you have it, guys. That is the unboxing of the Reveal Truck Series Dotson Off-Road Pickup. And it's also the intro to a Resurrection Series build of the Dotson. Like I said, I'm probably going to take some of these parts and, and put them in some of the, the older Dotson 620 builds that I'm building, there's going to be a long line series of Dotsons that, I, that I'm going to be putting on the channel just because I love them so much, you know, plus many, many other builds. But there again, this one right here does hold a special place in my heart because as a teenager, this was one of the first models that I got exposed to. To, into modeling, you know, kind of introduced me into modeling. And so I just want to, you know, do it justice. I can only hope that I do this kit justice, guys. You know, you can go so many ways with this. I mean, this is like a blank canvas just waiting, you know, for the artist to come along. So hopefully, you know, in my most humble Opinion. I only hope that I can do this this kit justice, and I hope that anybody out there that's following along on this particular bill understands where I'm coming from and follows along. So there again, guys. If you grab this kit or if you can get a hold of this kit, this is what's in it. This is what to look forward to. I say use your imagination and grow 
monumental gardens of styrene. All right, this is Model My 72 saying peace, love, and happiness. Thank you so much for blowing up the channel, keeping it alive, keeping it hot. This is a big shout out to all of my Model Mind 72 hardcore fans and all you new subscribers. Hit that bell to sm and smash the like button to stay on top of the styrene goodness. This is Model Mind 72 signing off from the Wicked Wizard Garage saying every day in the Wicked Wizard Garage is like a paradise in styrene heaven. And there's nothing like waking up and smelling the awesomeness of styrene goodness. Over and out.